is Al Aki with Origami by Aki and today we're going to make the beautiful origami butterfly. Okay, we're going to start with the square sheet of paper and you only need to have color on one side although we'll see later how part of the underside of the wing is actually going to be the back side so it would look a little bit better if you had color on both sides but one side is really sufficient. It'll be easier to show you with just one side. <laughs> So first, we're going to fold it in half like a rectangle. Okay. Unfold it. Unfold it in half the other direction. Then we're going to take one edge and just <clears throat> fold it to that middle line. Then fold the other edge just up to this point here. Okay. Now, when we open up, we're going to actually make a crease going this way. So, and I mention that because you don't want it to go this way. <laughs> so make sure you know where, where this part is. And then all we're going to do is make this crease Going this way, and to find that, you just go back and find your fold. It was in the middle, so let me just open this up again. Okay, so here we are. We're going to, when we fold it back, make a crease along this direction. And to do that, we just fold it back, and then fold this up along the middle line here. And then you see, when we open it back up, we have the crease I was talking about, which is going in this direction. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So all we do is just fold this up so that the two meet. And now, this is kind of a tricky part, we're going to open everything up, and we're going to uh, basically fold this inside out here. So what we're doing is we're opening this up, we're going to make this inside out fold. Do the same thing on this side, which is basically just reversing this fold like this. And so the result is it will look like this on this side and like this over here. So we're going to start with the part that looks like this. All we're going to do is take this and fold it up to the middle. And do that <clears throat> same thing on the other side. Okay. And when we flip it over, we have this little flap here. And what we're going to do is just fold the corner down. Kind of a 45 degree angle there from the middle. And then we're going to take this flap here and just match it up with that angle. Do the same thing on the other side. Okay. okay, now we have this this part here, which is uh, this is going to be the head. <clears throat> so we're going to fold this up. And it's going to fit right in into the middle here. And it's going to go a little bit past. So you see you have this little uh, part here, so it's not going to be flat. And it, it's just going to make it look a little nicer, more of a 3D effect. This is the head. I'm going to flip that over. So now the head is fitting in between this part here. And... We're just going to fold the head over once. So you have a little triangle sticking up. And at this point, we're going to fold back again. So it's, it makes like a little. Uh, so it goes this way and then it folds back. It's a little hard to see in this paper. <laughs> but now we're going to fold the whole thing in half going through the head. This is going to make the head a little bit more 
noticeable. Okay. And then we're going to fold the wings back at a an angle about maybe 30 degrees, I guess, like this to form the body of the butterfly on both sides. And, and pinch it very hard along that crease. And you're going to take the wings and kind of take your thumb and curl them up a little bit. And so the so from this part the butterfly of course is all one color. If you look on the bottom, which I guess you normally wouldn't on a butterfly, but this is the the other side of the paper. So if it was colored on the other side, you know, this would also be colored too. But generally you're just gonna look at the butterfly from the top. And so this is Al Aki with Origami by Aki. And that's how you make the beautiful origami butterfly. <laughs>